Hello, my name is Brian Allen and welcome to today's video tip. We are going to focus uh, today on how to clear your browser's cache. If you do this frequently, you will hopefully speed up your internet browsing experience and also avoid some problems. Since most people are using one of these three browsers, we will be covering the Google Chrome browser, the Mozilla Firefox browser, and the Internet Explorer browser. So enjoy the video. I'll try to make it really quick for you and I hope it gives you a hand when you need it. Okay, let's start off with the Google Chrome browser. If you open up your browser and then go up here to the little wrench, go ahead and click on that wrench on the right side. That will open this drop down selection. Slide on down to the tools, hover over that. Then I want you to come over this way and find the clear browsing data option. Click on that once. Now you'll notice what actually happened is an extra tab opened up. That's normal. All right, now we're going to have our clear browsing data options. I want you to go ahead and first look at the time. You can select a period of time that you would like to delete for. I just click uh, the beginning of time because I'm trying to really clean things out. I'm going to choose my options. These are my three favorites. I click clear the browsing data. and it should be go, good to go. Now from here, I, if I was actually having a problem and I kept locking up, I would actually close out the browser and possibly restart my computer. So, hope that helps. Let's move on to the next browser. Well, I don't know what happened here. We just finished up Google and my intention was to move on to Mozilla Firefox and some prankster put a picture of the family guy on my computer. Um, I don't know if this is a prankster, maybe divine intervention. For all of you watching the video, I do highly suggest you watch some episodes of The Family Guy and just pay attention to the talking dog, Stewie the super intelligent baby, and Quagmire. Um, people who do that frequently have better luck when it comes to clearing their cache on their internet browsers. So I just figured I'd throw that in there since this just happened to pop up. Okay, enough of that. Let's move on to Mozilla Firefox. This is uh, increasingly becoming a, a browser of choice for many, many people. Um, let's go ahead and look at the very top. First of all, this is currently what you see when you're looking at my Firefox browser. If you do not have this toolbar right here, the one that says File, Edit, View, History, Bookmarks, and Tools, I want you to go ahead and just right click on this bar find the gray area, right click, and then check off menu bar, navigation, bookmarks. We will be looking at the same header uh, toolbars up here. The only difference will be you and I may have different bookmarks. Okay? All right, but for now, let's go to tools. So again, we're in Mozilla Firefox, the browser, select tools, slide on down to clear recent history, click that once, and a box will pop up. I'm going to drag this to the center of the screen for us. Okay, just like before with the Google Chrome, we have an option for the time range. Go ahead and drop that down. I'm going to select everything. And then you can choose which portions you want to have cleared out. Again, for performance, all I normally click is the browsing and download history, the cache, um, site preferences, and uh, I'm good to go in, in most cases. From there I will click clear now. And that is about it for Mozilla Firefox. So hopefully between the Chrome and the Firefox you see some similarities with the location um, or I should say the labels once we find that location of the clearing cache areas and how to go ahead and, and clear that out. Let's close this out and go over to Internet Explorer. Oh, are you kidding me? Who did this? I'm sorry, I was trying to get over to Internet Explorer and obviously um, the uh, some that same prankster pulled up another picture here. This, I mean, this is no surprise to anybody why the Green Bay Packers would be on anyone's computer for that matter. They are the, the most dominant team in football history ever. Um, 
you know, the only games they didn't win are the ones they lost, and that was probably just a payoff or something like that. But anyhow, so here's uh, the most popular Super Bowl champions. Let me go ahead and see if I can get rid of this. This might take a while. These guys are pretty powerful. All right, I was finally able to get past the uh, the Green Bay Packers. Um, Again, I'm sure you're all fans. Uh, any intelligent person would be so. Uh, but let's move on to the Internet Explorer browser and how to clear the cache and improve your performance while surfing the Internet. What I'd like you to do is obviously log in to Internet Explorer. Come up here to the toolbar. Oh, let me get back to just like before. If you do not see this toolbar, this menu bar right here, please go ahead and right click in the top area and you can make your selection there. Okay, so make sure that the menu bar is actually checked. That will give you these options right here. Click on Tools, and then right there at the top, Delete Browsing History. Click on that once, and then just like before in the other two browsers, we have a selection of what exactly we would like to, to clear out. I'm just going to go with History, Temporary Internet Files, and this was defaulted. And then I'm going to come down here and click delete just take a few moments and we should be good to go again after I do that I normally like to close out the browser itself if I'm still having problems I might do a, uh, an actual restart on the computer so I hope this video has helped you guys out a little bit hope you have a great week and I look forward to helping you out with the next video tip take care for now